Hey guys, this is a really quick video. I'm gonna show you guys how to fix the unable to load on QCAP Pro. So basically, QCAP Pro is when you go to create a movie, you put in a title, so you put like whatever title you want, and then you press on create, and you just press on done. You can do whatever you want, like you got a photo, add a video, but then when you go press on movies and go back and go back into it, sometimes it would say unable to load, and everything you did would be would be deleted. So like it would just say unable to load. And there's no way of getting it back. You would just have to like you know go back, delete this because nothing you could do. And we move it, and they have to start a new one, and then do all that again. So what I do is like um, when I create one, I'll just like do all my stuff besides be before I like I go back. So like I'll like make the movie, right? I'll tap on create. I'll do this. I have my photo and video, and then I'll press on these three dots. The th I mean the three um the arrow point right that thing on the top um second one from the top right, and then that I can export to uh, my YouTube um to YouTube or my camera roll. So if I'm done, I'll, I'll export my camera roll. So if I go back to movies and it doesn't save, then it's not a big deal. But I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that. So. It's not a hundred percent fits, but it does work like ninety five percent of the time. So I just created a movie, and I just I did like a big you know a long title, and then it said like unable to load. But if you do short titles, like you see I have right there, Fletch three beta, and then anti revoke, just like a one word two word title, and you go into it, you just test it, go into it, add a photo, add a video, add any, anything you want. You got just a photo, just a video. You got both, do whatever you want, and then type of movies. It'll go back, and if you see that's still there, like the, the screen's still there, then you're good. You go back into it and keep going back and in. You're fine. But if you see, like, it's just a black screen, that means when you go back into it, it will say unable to load. And that means it's not working. So, like, before you do anything, I'll just, like, export just a photo video and just make sure, like, it's going to save. That's what I would do. Because, like, if you do, like, if you just go into it and you make it the first time and you do all this work. And you're like, okay, I'll just go back into it later and you press on movies. I'm pretty sure a lot of you probably learned the hard way of that. And then everything's gone. You can work for hours and it's everything's gone that you did. So, this is a quick fix that could save... A lot of frustration, a lot of hours of hard work because I actually had this actually happened to me. Like when I was like I wasn't aware of the glitch or like what was wrong. I did like a whole project that took like an hour and a half. So much edit I did, and like I was so concentrated forever. And then when I go back into the um the movie or t the movie I did, like when I edit out, I go back to the movies, and then I go back to it. It's it says unable to load and it's 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 gone. There's nothing I can do. So I was so pissed and frustrated. So hopefully you one time it happened to you like hopefully none but like if it did happen to you you watch this video and you're like okay now i know what to do for the future and it'll never happen again and the thing is i like qcap pro i don't want to use another app and this qcap pro is updated for you know 11 about like 10 11 months so who knows when usually they upload update like every like eight seven six months but it hasn't updated in 10 months so who knows when they're going to update again hopefully they will because it's a paid application and usually like developers like to update it because you know they get money for it because when people buy it they want it to work so hopefully it works. I mean, hopefully it's up. Hopefully it's updated in the near future. But on that, this is the fix for now. Um, yeah, guys, peace.